Hello everyone, this is Neha and in today's video, we will learn some tips of clearing German Mundlich Prüfung. Mundlich Prüfung means speaking. I have already created some videos on Lesenfestehen, Sprachbauschnein, uh, Hörenfestehen and Schriftliche Ausdruck on all these above four parts of German mm -hmm. B1's Prüfung. I have I made the videos on my last two weekends. So you can go and check out the previous videos on these levels. But in this video today, I will only talk about Mündlich Ausdruck. Mündlich Ausdruck means speaking. So in speaking, we have total three parts, Teil 1, Teil 2, Trial 3. And in Teil 1, we have Ein Ander Kennen Lernen, means to learn about each other. So it is general introduction. Then in the Teil 2, we have Über ein Thema Sprechen which means to talk about a topic. So they'll give you a topic and you have to talk on it. Then you have Gemeinsam etwas planen. So this is the last part and you will plan something together. So maybe a farewell party or a picnic. But to prepare all these three parts, you will have a vorbereitung site of 15 minutes. So preparation time you have before the Mündlich Prüfung means speaking is 15 minutes. And now let's see the detail of each tile and I will give some tips about each tile. And before going into the details about each tiles and tips for each tile, I would like to tell you that for writing site of 15 minutes, you have to only spend on tiles Y. So tile 1 and tile 3, you have to prepare in advance and it is very basic. You can do it. So we will only focus about tiles Y when you are in the exam. Today we will talk about the tips for tile lines, tiles Y, tile dry, but we will only do the preparation, use the preparation time um, in the exam for tiles Y. So this is the first tip of the day and I will explain you why also. Okay. So now let's start with tile lines. So tile lines for the speaking is the general introduction. So that doesn't mean that you have to introduce only yourself, but you will be assigned with the partner and you have to get to know about each other. So you have to try to keep it a small talk and go question by question. So let's say your partner is starting. So he or she will ask you a name and you will answer it. Then you will ask the next, next question. You have to try to ask the questions also. So don't only answer the questions, but also um, ask questions and it will be turn by turn and the next tip is collect all sort of questions you are seeing when you are preparing for the exam so suppose you are preparing you uh, got the reference for for three or four model test paper and you have seen 20 type of questions which can be asked in the introduction so prepare for all type of questions how can you ask the question and how can you answer those questions so that when uh, in the exam, you are sitting in the exam, you don't need to spend your time for the writing site in preparing for this uh, tile. There are very light questions and easy questions which can be asked in this section. So try to prepare in advance and utilize the uh, same time for the tiles. Why? I know when you are going in exam, you at least need to know what type of questions you are going to ask. So use the for writing site of only one minute to only know what are the questions you are going to ask or answer. Apart from this, for tile lines, there is a possibility that your proofer, your examiner may ask some questions from you. It did not happen when I gave my exam, but there is a possibility that they can ask. So what kind of questions they can ask? They can ask what are your hobbies and uh, maybe free time activities they can ask, fry site activity and, and what did you do on this weekend, weekend, woken end day. So these kind of the questions they can ask. So prepare these questions also in advance so that you will not be shocked and uh, you will not be stressed when they ask you extra questions. Okay, so let's proceed with the tiles Y now. We have spoken about tile lines and now we will go to tiles Y. Also, these were the tips which I used in my exam. So if you guys know something extra other than this, let me know in the comments. So now we are at the tiles Y and the first tip for tiles Y, I've already told you, use the preparation time, maximum preparation time for this tile because you have to collect advantages for tile and knock tile for this topic. Suppose here we have the topic group and rise in. Suppose you like to travel in group. So you will talk about the advantages 
of traveling in group and here this lady is also um traveling in group and she likes to travel in group so you will talk about that you are of the same opinion as this lady and these are the advantages of traveling in group so maybe you could use some of the vocabulary from the um, given article also next thing is when you are starting to talk about the topic you have to start that you have read an article so you will say to your partner in deutsch weisen sie am diesem wochenende um ich habe einen artikel über gruppenreisen thema gelesen after that you can say eine frau hat diese artikel geschrieben und sie sind der meinung das bei gruppenreisen kann man neue leute kennenlernen so this line which i used after das i picked it from the article itself so you can also use the same and you can modify also but you have to give the twist as per you um you should not rely the whole on this article so after you introduce the lady and about the article you have to come on your opinion that uh, ich sehe auch so ich bin der um, gleiche meinung so you you can say that you are of same opinion or you think differently so after you uh, mention that you think the same suppose you you agree with the lady that traveling in group is good so you have to give two or three advantages also so suppose you can say weniger planung stress man kann günstiger und gut reise machen uh, then zum beispiel uh, uh, airbnb booken und uh, sparen so viel geld and then you can also say jemand uh, auf ihre fotos klicken zum beispiel so these kind of um, examples you have to give for the advantages if you agree with the opinion so this these example was specific for this article but you when you get some article in the exam you have to prepare yourself that what kind of words you will use so use good words um, advantages for the um, for explaining the, the topic and after this you also have to end the conversation by asking your partner if she or he agrees with your opinion or she is of different opinion so now let's summarize all tips for tiles why first tip was use the maximum uh, preparation time for this tile because you have to collect advantages or disadvantages for this top particular topic next tip was you go in the hierarchy so first introduce the article then the person who has written this article then talk about their opinion if the person likes to travel in the group or she doesn't like to travel in the group so once you tell them uh, tell your partner their opinion after that comes your opinion so if you agree with the uh, person or you don't agree with the article so once you um, after you agree or disagree you have to uh, explain why you agree or disagree so to explain that you have to give some advantages or disadvantages of traveling in group and for that only you need maximum vorbereitung zeit means preparation zeit because sometimes you don't get um, good words when you are in the exam stress so after this once you explain your opinion also you have to end the conversation by asking your partner what does he or she thinks whether she agrees or disagree with the opinion then your partner will continue the conversation now it's a turn for tile try it's been already very long video i will try to be very quick so we will proceed with the tile try now to start for the tile dry first step is it is always the planning of something maybe a party or a picnic or anything and to plan a party what what are the things which you need you need place you need people you need time and drinks food and maybe a gift if it is a birthday party or farewell party so if it is a picnic then it is a general thing you don't need a gift so all these things which you uh, always need to plan a party you can always pre decide the words of these things so suppose in the party planning there will be a bill sharing and what is the word for sharing to share means tile in so we can always use tile in in the party planning another word which you can always use is responsibilities so who will take care of what responsibility so taking care means uber nehmen so taking care or taking over means uber nehmen and what is the word for responsibilities it is verantwortlichkeiten so verantwortlichkeiten means responsibilities and uber nehmen means taking over so these kinds of words you can always put in your party planning conversation 
to summarize you always have to prepare yourself in advance and uh, collect some words which you can always put in the conversation of party planning this will actually help you a lot and if you have prepared well in advance for your exam you will not need much time to do this conversation so guys this is it for today i know it has been long video but we actually needed to go in detail for all the tips for every tile and also i have explained other parts of bein's proofung telc exam in my previous videos i will give the links of these videos in the description please go and watch the videos if you haven't watched it yet and if anyone is giving bein's proofung please share the video with them also and if there is something else which you would like to tell me and uh, maybe i missed some tip please let me know in the comments i will meet you guys once again tomorrow with new german vocabulary for now off with the same and bismarck in everyone